Hi, I'm Dr. Pooja Jaising, Adobe eLearning Evangelist, and today I'm here again to share yet another sneak peek into the next version of Captivate. Today we will see how you can create high definition screen captures using the new video demo feature. Click the video demo option on uh, the splash screen and hit record. It gives the timer. And today what I want to record is how I'm creating a color palette for my next e-learning project. So I'm just uh, moving these handles to uh, get the right shade for my project. I am kind of happy with it. So, okay, I want it to be more of green. And this is, I think this looks good. Just need to adjust a few more values. Yes, this is perfect. So um, I will end the recording here because I've got my color palette right. And now what Adobe Captivate does is it shows you the project in a preview uh, and plays the video in full screen so that you can see the output immediately. Here you can see that how uh, uh, nicely the video is being shown and it has a high FPS which gives you clear and crisp picture. If you are happy with this output, you can directly publish by clicking this button or you can upload it to YouTube uh, by clicking the YouTube ready button. If you're not happy and you want to edit out a, a particular section or add pan and zoom transition, then you can go and click the edit button that will take you to the video editing mode. So here what you can do is you can add pan and zoom. Let me show that to you. Suppose at a third second, I want to highlight this area by adding a zoom. Uh, I want to zoom in here. So I will hit pan and zoom button and that will give me this uh, rubber band and I can drag uh, the handles and resize, reposition it on top of the circle so that it uh, zooms in here. I can even change the speed with which uh, it uh, you know uh, zooms in and then I can go to uh, maybe I'm going to six second and I want to pan to some other area from here. I can just go and click add pan and zoom and drag it to the area where I want it to pan. So with this um, we can also uh, maybe go to the third frame and this time I want to just zoom out just go and click zoom out and it will bring uh, the view in the full screen mode here you can also trim out a certain portion so probably you want to trim out the section from 15 second to 18 second all you have to do is click the uh, trim button it will give you those these handles and uh, then you can go and position them and hit the trim button again and it will remove that unwanted area from your project you can also add transitions by uh, clicking these diamond shaped buttons so as soon as you click them uh, you get uh, the transitions panel here where you can uh, find a lot of nice cool transitions you can add any of these uh, and it will be applied to the timeline you can also edit out the mouse pointers by clicking the edit button and clicking edit uh, mouse button what it will do is it will show you wherever you have added the mouse pointer and when you click any of the mouse it will show you the shape in which uh, the pointer is moving you can easily go and change it out if you want to smoothen it or you want to change the position of the mouse that you're using uh, you can easily do that uh, by clicking on it and moving the mouse uh, currently and after you are done you can go and select edit mouse pointer again and it will uh, bring you back to the normal mode you can also split you can add insert objects uh, picture in picture here and you can create cool uh, simulations using the video demo feature in high definition thanks for watching this sneak peek and keep looking for the future sneak peeks from us